Yo everyone, how's it going? Welcome to the channel, welcome to another video, and today we are doing the second part of... No we're not, we're doing the third part? I think it's the third part. Yeah, uh, third part of the um, Twin Otter. So, this video is literally gluing on the wings, gluing the wings onto the fuselage, uh, in a fortnight's time, no pun intended, in a fortnight's time they, I will be doing the engines because the engines go on the wings. There are a little bit of detail I've got to do off camera just because it's going to be time consuming. So you have a look at the instructions. So we're doing this step, this step, this step, this step today. These little triangles are off camera. The engines are next video, just so you know. And these little things I'm also going to be doing. Uh, there are a few I don't actually have to do. But we will worry about that when it comes. Next week will be the second bit of the typhoon. This isn't glued together, it's just put in just for storage purposes. Anyway, let's get cr let's get to cracking on this video. So firstly the 31 and 21. So 21. 31. So I presume they just go on like that. Uh 31, 21, I presume they just click on like that. I've got a new cover glue, uh, I've got a few just off camera on the right hand side. That's the other one, that's the other two. I've got a ton in this box, you can't quite see it. That here, I've got a ton of my stuff in there. Anyway, that's not I've got zero. Oops. Zero relevance to this vid, so there's no point in me talking about that because it's got no relevance to the video whatsoever. So there we go. And then you can see where that thing goes, it goes there. So I'm just going to get a peg and leave that wing to dry. Should only take a couple of seconds to dry. And do the same for the next, the other wing. Um, I'm not sure if I keep mentioning this. I know I keep mentioning it. To myself, I need to do it. Uh, upgrading my glue, but first of all, I'm going to use all these glues just so they don't go to waste. Some of the paints I'm just going to bin straight off the back. You can add all. Uh, never mind. Don't worry about what I just said. I will do a whole. I'm doing another video in a couple of weeks on kits I want next year when the new ones get released. And um, I'm not sure. Uh, I might do it, might not do it. I'm not actually 100% sure yet. I can't even see what I'm doing. Sorry about that. My hand's in the way. There's a shadow. I apologise for that. So, this one doesn't go on as easy. Oops. What was that? There we go. That one does. Probably broke something. Hashtag not my fault. Um, anyway, I'm while I wait for these to dry, I will just basically talk. They should only take a couple of seconds to dry. I'll just leave them on screen just so you can see them. So, um, depending on how many kits I get at Christmas and what I buy at Christmas and everything this Christmas is only what a month and a bit away month just over a month and a half away now it's not very long at all I mean it's November the 7th as of date recording Saturday the 10th when it goes up so yeah it's not too long away now one month two weeks and a day until Christmas not like I'm counting I'm just having a look at my calendar which is just off the screen Um. But anyway, I might do a Christmas, because my birthday's also 
quite close. That's only five days after Christmas, 30th of December. Um, I might do a Christmas slash birthday haul of the models because that's what I mainly get. If it's not models, it's clothing. It's not. Blech. It's usually models, clothing, or money. Nine times out of ten, it's money. As I've got to that age where it's money. So I buy my own kits, buy my own stuff, because obviously I don't just get this. I do have other hobbies. I play football, I play goalie, so I need to find that stuff. So that's not get gloves and all that stuff is not cheap, trust me. It's really not that cheap. Um, hopefully when my exams are over, this reminds me, I will be going back to a Saturday Sunday upload. Although I have still yet to make a start on the helicopter. The tiger. Yep. Uh, apparently I'm doing a diorama, but I'm not doing the diorama anymore. I was going to do it like it's bombing a place, but I doubt I'll do the diorama now. Uh, I'm still doing the diorama with the RS Centenary kit. I've just got to find some wood and some other bits and bobs and a little bit of land. Um, I want you. I want to know. I'm thinking of doing it over the ocean, over like the White Cliffs of Dover, because obviously they were iconic during the Second World War. Because obviously that's where Britain knew. So let me know down below whether you want me to do it over the ocean or over the White Cliffs. It'll only be a small little mock-up. Anyway, these should be dry by now. I can take these pegs off. And glue them. So I don't even need to look at the instructions. That slots on there. Actually, I better just double check the instructions actually. Before I jump to any conclusions. Uh huh. Nope. Good job I did check the instructions because I was about to put them on the wrong way around. So, wing there, wing there. So that's how the kit's going to look. So it is, I think it's 30 centimeters long, 27.3 centimeters from tip to tip. You can't see it just off camera. Sorry about that. I'm going to sort my desk out again. I only sorted it out the other week, but it looks like a bomb's hit it already. Just because my desk is so messy. And try and make it more of a recordable environment. I'm getting a new cutting mat. I'll probably get that soon. Very soon. Hopefully by the end of the month I'll have a new cutting mat. But first, like I said, I play keeper. I need to get a new set of goalie gloves, and they're not cheap. Not the ones I want are not cheap. They're like 20 or quid. Uh, well, it is cheap, but when you've got no job, no money, no income, no pocket money, it's a lot of money. Especially when you've got no one giving you any money, and the only way you earn money is when people give you money, like change. Let me go tell you, buy something, you can keep the change, that's the only time I ever get money, really. Anyway, any, anyway this video is dragged on a bit, sorry. I will be editing it, so it will be shorter than what it currently is on screen. Also, if you're willing to edit my videos, and you have to be a subscriber, and I, you have to give me the video back. This is why I do it all by my own advice on my, yeah, by myself. But if you are really good at editing, please let me know, because I need somebody that's good at editing videos. That will do it for free. So I'm not after any business going, oh yeah, we're editing videos for like £5 per video because that's £10 a week, that's 40 quid a month. I'm not exactly got that amount of money. I might as well just do it myself, it won't cost me a dime or a penny or whatever you want to call it. It won't cost me a single penny because I'm a UK. <clears throat> Sorry about that, my voice went croaky. So, that slot's on there. And that slots on there. And then all I've got to do is find weights to keep these up. I will not split. Shit. Sorry about that language. I'm just going to use some paint pots just to hold up this.
sorry guys. There we go. So I got the wings being held up. So until next time. Bye.